Hey guys, Emily from Foodbox HQ here. Today we're doing an updated review on Sunbasket. So just to give you a general overview of what Sunbasket is, they're a meal delivery service that focuses on organic, sustainably farmed ingredients that are delivered right to your door in order to keep you healthy. They've got a couple different meal plan options. They've got paleo options, they've got gluten-free options, they have vegetarian options, and they even have family options. So if you wanted to do something more for your family as opposed to just, you know, a smaller option, they have that too. Since we did this last time, they've definitely made some changes that we're really excited about. So one of the first ones we noticed is the recipe book. Originally, you would just get the three cards of the recipes that you had that week, and that was kind of it. They were loose, you know, you kind of could lose them. They were a little bit flimsy, you might get a little bit of something on them. Now they send you the whole week. So each week, they have 23 different recipes that you can choose from. Even if you don't choose, all of these recipes, obviously nobody's getting 23 a week, you still get every single recipe that they're offering, which is really cool because now you can try some stuff on your own or maybe, you know, see next time it comes around, you know that you wanna order that one because it looks really good, all that kind of stuff. I like the design a lot more. It's a lot more legible, a lot easier to follow. You've got all your ingredients and your nutritional facts and very detailed nu nutritional facts. It's not just your calorie count, it's also all your different levels of, of different vitamins and all that kind of stuff, your nutrients. Then on the other side, you've got all your directions. Now, these directions are significantly more succinct and a little bit more clear than they used to be. I'm definitely excited about that because anything that makes my life easier, this is definitely great because it introduces you to these new techniques or even just cooking in general. Very excited about that. You can also even rip out these uh, making it very easy to just kind of use your recipe or you can keep them in the book if you want to keep them all together One other thing that we noticed immediately is that the packaging is a little bit different. So let's take a look inside the box All right, so first of all the box opens a little bit differently than it used to but it's talking about You know your protocols what you're supposed to do You can always go on their website to sort of see what you should be doing But they want to make sure that you're recycling everything so the box itself is completely recyclable <laughs> And then inside, oops, sorry about that. We open it up and we've got our packaging material. So this insulation here is made from recycled paper. So not only is it recyclable, it is recycled itself. So just to show you what it's made of inside, we're gonna open it up. You've got all that recycled paper in there, all ground up into a pulp to keep your food clean, cold, and safe. So then we've got, you know, obviously a little bit more packaging, stuff like that. But even the ice pack, this ice pack, it says it's made from water and cotton, and that's the inside. So that's all this gel that's in there. It's easy, you can just cut the corner, pour it out, and recycle the container around it. So they're definitely making strides to not only have sustainable ingredients, but sustainability with their packaging and their shipping, which is definitely something that, you know, a lot of meal delivery services are sort of looking to innovate. And this seems to be one of the most eco-friendly ones I've seen so far. So let's take a look at the ingredients that we got in our box. So the ingredients are gonna be separated and organized into these paper bags. Again, sustainability. Anything that doesn't fit in the paper bags, they may sound separately like this big thing of kale just wouldn't quite fit in there. As well as these sweet potato noodles, they're just a little bit fragile, so I think they didn't wanna put them in the bag. We're gonna be making the Mexican meatball soup with butternut squash and cilantro. So we've got all of the ingredients for that right in here. And it's all organized and pre-measured, so we're just gonna have to chop some stuff up. They send the meats separately. They're gonna be underneath the ice pack or by the ice pack so they're a little bit colder. These are for our other recipes. The other ones we got were the green goddess steak salad with kale and roasted carrots. And then we also have the hoisin glazed chicken with glass noodle and cucumber salad. But we're feeling like a soup today so we're definitely gonna try this out. So let's get started.
All right, let's do a taste test. Get some of the meatball in there, some of the butternut squash. Well, the vegetables are really nice and tender. Still a little bit hot, but. Oh, wow. Those meatballs are so flavorful. That's really good. I like the combo of the different vegetables. I wouldn't necessarily put these together like a Mexican meatball with butternut squash, but I think it complements really well. Everything's not overcooked, which is really good. It's not super soggy, but it still has, you know, it's still soft. It still feels like a soup. And I honestly, I was a little skeptical about the cabbage in the soup, but I actually really like it. It gives a little bit of a crunch. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna finish this. I'll see you later. Hey guys, so just some final thoughts on Sunbasket. Definitely love the improvements that they've made, especially their recipe cards. That's definitely one of my favorite things. They're significantly more legible. They're also easier to follow. It's a little bit more succinct, a little bit more direct. They've got little things like chef tips. They've got better photos, more information about your recipe. All that stuff is really important, especially if you wanna learn more, if you're really interested in cooking and everything, I really like that. Something else they do really well and that they've sort of built upon is their sustainability in regards to environmentally friendly packaging. You know, they've definitely made strides with their insulation and their gel packs as well. That definitely makes them one of the top companies when it comes to environmentally friendliness. And then lastly, I love that they have so much variety. It's a little bit hard when you're looking for, you know, something paleo or something gluten-free. A lot of these companies will only have like one or two options, whereas they will have a full menu for you. They're gonna have a ton of options for you to decide from. It's not a, it's not a second thought. It's a full, you know, a full-fledged meal plan that you kind of get access to, which I really love. Now, their taste was delicious. I loved that soup. It was really good. Definitely something I'm going to be making again. But yeah, if you want to learn more or if you want to see our original in-depth review, both of those links are going to be below and we'll see you next time.